scary things. Um, have you looked in a mirror lately? You really go crazy with all that paper. You think I'm the one that's going crazy? Think there's any chance that wanted Moloch would launch an attack here? His target's probably Loringen, but stay sharp just in case. He might try to break open the bug cage as a diversion. Wanted Moloch? Loringen? Hmm. First that demon Rex Helavis, and then Eleanor betrays us? We're never gonna catch a break. Quit whining. Cleaning up messes is our job. Looks like our Abbey buddies are up to something. And the bug cage. That barrier, I assume? If so, it won't be long before they find out we broke in. Then we should make our exit while we can. How goes it? Savit! Easy there, bro. I don't got time to spar today. Got a date lined up. That artifact you've got belongs to Eifried. Why do you have it? Just picked it up off the ground somewhere. Don't screw with me, tough guy. I have ways of making you talk. Ha! <laughs> I wonder how much pain gets you to open up. You're the one about to be tested. It's not up to you how this goes. If I want to talk, we'll talk. But if I want to fight, we'll fight. What are you? I'd play more, but I don't want to keep old Pointy Beard waiting. We'll chat some more later with our fists. Wait! Aizen! We need to get the flowers to everyone on the ship! You can handle it! But you're... <sighs> Let's head back, Laffy said. All right. Things Avid was holding? 
What do you think that was? From the sound of it, it seemed to belong to Ifrit. I've never seen any object or art quite like it. Maybe it's that relic Ifrit brought back from a continent across the sea. An art from another continent. Do you think Aizen will be all right? That Moloch seemed to know what he was doing. I'd rather we just stayed out of his way, but... First the throne, and now here. What is Zavid after, anyway? He was probably just making up that date business. But still, old pointy beard? Just like Ifrid. When I was talking with Benwick, he said Ifrid had a pointy beard. You don't say. Then I bet Zavid is that wanted Moloch the Abbey's looking for. Yeah. He must be aware they're after him. And then he baited Aizen into following him, using something that belonged to Ifrid. And I'm pretty sure Aizen knew that, but he went after him all the same. Ugh, this can only go well, I'm sure. Is Aizen in trouble? It doesn't matter either way, if his Corsair scourge goes untreated. For now, let's get back to the ship. It anymore. I can't deal with life in this village. There you go, with the whining again. Those two, they seem to be rather upset. Best stay out of it! They're going at it, hammer and tongs! The phrase is hammer and tongs. I'm not whining. It's been ten years, and the village is no better off than when we started. Every year it gets colder, and every year our harvest gets worse. And the risk of demon blight hasn't gone away. Your point? Compared to other regions, Westgand has fewer cases of demon blight. Other areas are suffering worse from the cold and the demons. I'd say we're better off here than anywhere else. You're saying we're lucky that all we have to worry about is cultivating this inhospitable land? Don't be so impatient. We'll see results. Westgand has incredible potential. If we keep working this land, eventually it will become a prosperous place. Maybe not now. But in a hundred years or a thousand, our descendants will have joy and plenty. That's enough for me. There you go again. Who cares about ancestors? I'm talking about... Good man, your words have moved me. As an exorcist, I promise to work my hardest to end the demon blight and help people like you find security. Oh, thank you for your kind words, young exorcist. Then I have a request. How about you start helping by marrying this fool son of mine? What? Ever since his lover gave him the slip, he's been whining like this non-stop. I'm... very sorry, but that wasn't exactly what I had in mind. No much. It's unusual to see one this close to the sea. Hey, I thought of a poem! Day at Port Renied. A frog jumps into the void. The sound of the sea. Magilu? What was that? Just a little poem that popped into my head. My inspiration came from pondering the terror a frog would feel if it unwittingly leapt into the salty ocean. Th that's... I don't get it at all. I got another one! Skinny little frog, Magilu is on your side. Do not give up hope. Um... I guess that one is about... rooting for a frog? That's right. I once bet a fortune on a game of chance involving frogs. That was my inspiration for this one. What do you think? Poetic, isn't it? I think you have a gambling problem. So... did this skinny frog win? Nope. I lost my entire bet. I think we can call that poetic justice. Mm. 
We brought back your solitomas. Drink up. You've saved us! But where's the first mate? We bumped into some wannabe tough guy Moloch and he just took off after him. What? That must have been Zavid! Why didn't you guys follow him? And leave you all with the Corsair Scourge? Yes! Aizen's the one in danger here. Is it because the Abbey is after Zavid? So you even knew about it? I heard the details from a merchant who deals with the Abbey. Some big shot exorcist named Melchior has set up a trap for Zavid and Loringen. If Aizen gets caught up in that, he might not make it out alive. So now there's Melchior to worry about. Why is Lord Melchior assuming direct command to capture Zavid? Wait, that's not important. What matters is I can turn Lafayette's head over to him and finally return to the Abbey. Melchior is a legate. A powerful enemy, trap or no. Ugh, you guys are useless! Well, fine. If you're not going to go help him, we will. What makes you think you're capable of being any help? Would you let an ally get slaughtered just because you were scared? What? We want to save him. Maybe we'll lose. It still won't stop us. We are the ones who decide our fates. Only us. That's just the creed of Eifried's pirates. Uh, you're a real hothead, you know that? Nobody said anything about not helping Aizen. Huh? You all stay here. Take your medicine like good little boys. And be ready to welcome back your first mate and captain. The captain? Why else would Aizen knowingly barge into a trap, if not to save Eifried? Oh, of course! Leave the ship and crew to me! Here, this one's for you. Those pirates haven't a lick of sense in them. They don't let reason dictate who they protect. <sighs> if you say so, demon. Now, about where Aizen's headed. Those exorcists were talking about some place called Loringen. Yes. It's a tower in the northern part of Westgand where the exorcists train. Lines up with what Benwick told us. That must be the place. There must be a lot of exorcists. Hang in there, Aizen. That'll take more than basic exorcists to do him in. We ought to pity any poor exorcists who meet the Reaper. Right! Let's work together and find him! Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Um, yeah, if you enjoyed it, then please press the follow button, it helps immensely. And I'm uh, off to get some lunch. I may be back later, but I also have an appointment this afternoon. So have a nice day, be great, and thank you for watching. Bye.